family name of Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. Uh, in this novel management treatment methods, I will discuss about terzeptide, monjura injection for diabetes and obesity. I am Dr. Abdul Malik, PhD Pharmacology, College of Pharmacy, University of Sargodha. Now, please subscribe my channel for more videos and watch this video up to the end. Now, we go toward the basic terzeptide dose and dosage form. Dosage form of this drug is uh, injection. So, FDA approves Lily's Monjero, uh, that is Terzeptide, this is generic name, this is the trade name, and this uh, is the company that has developed this one. So, injection first and only GIP and GLP-1 ag receptor agonist for the treatment of adults with type 2 diabetes. So, what is GIP? It is an analog of, basically this terzeptide is analog of gastric inhibitory polypeptide, GIP. This is the first mechanism that has been introduced in this uh, drug. So, terzeptide, a human hormone which stimulate release of insulin from pancreas. This is not only working on GIP, but also effect, uh, dual effect on the GLP-1-2. So, terzeptide is a linear polypeptide of 39 amino acids. Manjura is available in 6 dosage for, dosages. For example, doses 2.5, 5, 7.5, 10, and 12.5, and 15 mg auto-injector pen with pre-attached hidden needle for diabetic and obesity patients. So, we we'll go towards the structure of terzeptide that has 39 amino acids and the structure related to a GIP, gastric inhibitory polypeptide that is found in our intestine. So, what is the Monjero injection shown? This is once weekly injection that has been given in the pen form, for example, in 5 milligram, in 10 milligram, and 15 milligram has been shown here. So, we we'll go towards the Monjero injection that is given for once weekly. Monjero is the trade name, and Terzeptide is the generic name, uh, and the different doses are given here. Uh, here is the structure of uh, injection of this Monjero, how uh, it will be applied to the patient and this is given for once weekly. So, terzeptide mechanism and patent, Eli Lilly first applied for patent in 2016. Terzeptide may potentially be a competitor for existing diabetic medication, the medications for example, semaglutide, liraglutide and exenatide, manufactured by Novo Nordisk. So, this is the competitor for these drugs. These are the uh, a GLP-1 agonist basically, GLP-1 agonist and these are also given in injectable formulation. So, terzeptide has greater affinity to GLP receptor than to GLP-1 receptor and this dual agonist which produces greater reduction of greater reduction of hyperglycemia, less uh, in decrease of low, uh, doing uh, low uh, glucose level in the blood compared to a selective GLP-1 receptor agonist. Terzeptide is perhaps the most potent agent developed today to tackle the global obesity problem of obesity and diabetes that can be called diabetes. This is the only newer drug, first mechanism that have been shown and uh, activity is very strong. Mechanism of action of terzeptide has been shown in the intestine, for example in the small intestine, there are the two major cells, K cells and L cells. So, L cells and uh, K cells form these uh, basically GLP and GIP. So, here is the GLP-1 agonist and here is the GIP uh, terzeptide act on both of these. And what are their function in three major organs of the body? There are multiple other function in the other organs of the body, but we have shown here three major. For example, brain, in it uh, decreases appetite, it decreases food intake, it increases the weight loss. So, in another hand, if you go towards the um, pancreas that is shown, so here it increases insulin secretion, it increases insulin synthesis and it increases beta cell survival. These are the major functions of the, of the terzeptide. Now, in the adipose tissue that is very important uh, in obesity and diabetes patients, so white adipose tissue, uh, it increases lipolysis, GLP-1, it increases lipogenesis, GIP, and avoids ectopic fat deposition. This drug is only given for the uh, type 2 diabetes patient, not for type 1 diabetes. So, now, what are the major adverse effects of this drug? Transeptide has slightly lesser extent of adverse effects. Patient also reported reduced appetite. Further, uh, other reported uh, adverse effects include dyspepsia, constipation, abdominal pain, dizziness, and hypoglycemia are the other adverse effects of this drug. So, we have finished this one. If you have any question, you can write in the comment section. Thank you very much for your listening, for your attention.